and welcome to the Cinema 4D Quick Tips. In this video, I want to show you how to use the new loop selection options that come with Cinema 4D S22. So let's go to Select, Loop Selection, and here you can see that we are in edge mode and this should allow us to select edge loops, as you can see here. Okay. So here in the options, you can see that we've got a new stop at selections option. And if we check that, you can see that the selection preview already stops at this selection here. And if we select, you will just select half of the sphere. And if we hold down shift, we can add another selection to the existing one. So this comes in pretty handy. The next thing I want to show you is the stop at non quads because usually you would create a loop that goes all around the sphere. But if you select stop at non quads, the selection will always stop at polygons that are not quads, like triangles, for example, or angons. And then there's also the option to stop at poles. And all of this also works with polygons and point selections. Okay, where could we use this in production? Let's go to the T-Rex here. And let's say we want to create some cuts for UV unwrapping. And let me bring back the options here. Let's say we want to, well, stop at poles is actually pretty good. We want to create a loop on the mouth edge. So we want to use this and stop at poles will stop here. And then we will add this part here to the selection by holding down shift. And after that, we will add the top part and in the end, the other side. We could also do that with mirror selection, but here we go. That's it. And now we could use this as an edge for cutting UVs. If we go to polygon mode, we could, for example, create a loop selection here and another one here and then take stop at selections and create some sort of harness for the T-Rex here. Thanks for watching! If you enjoy our quick tips, please like, comment and subscribe!